says, you alone are my rock. You alone are my rock. Young people, I want to tell you, you've got to begin to build your life on a sure foundation from an early age. You see a lot of folks that are going through hell in their life, they can tell you one thing. They wish when they were younger, they had made some different decisions. Amen. They can tell you the reason why. They can tell you what they're telling you is because if they were in your position and they could go back to their teenage years or their early years, they would do some things differently. If they could go back to their teenage years, some of the older women would tell you they wouldn't have hung out with that nappy-headed Negro that they found themselves hooked up to. Amen. If they could go back in their early years, some of these fellas would tell you they wish they didn't connect to some of the friends they connected to. But if they had only started to build on the right foundation from the start. You got to build on the right sound foundation. Some of y'all building right now on Tupac. On Sorry, they ain't building on Tupac no more. Amen. That's all this. They listening to these fellas that can't even talk properly. They building on Lil Wayne and, 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 and 25 Cent. I mean 50 Cent. Amen. They building on all of these other people. Kanye West talking about Jesus walks with him. I ain't wondering, Kanye, if Jesus walking with you. I know he walking with you. But what I'm wondering is, are you walking with him? Nas nah, talking, but he is God's son because he got um, bands and friends. But guess what, Nas? You can't be Jesus. Um, Jay-Z, you can't be God's son. Amen. And kind in the flesh because guess what? Yeah, Tim's ain't big enough to fit in his shoes. Amen. Why? Because he is the only sure foundation. That's why I'm here to let you young people know, whilst you're young, begin to build on that right foundation. Amen. Instead of listening to Lil Wayne and all of them pop in some Monty G, pop in some Mighty One. As a matter of fact, go back, pop in some Kirk Franklin, some Hezekiah Walker. Instead of all of that foolishness y'all putting in your spirit and wondering why you're having sex. Amen. And an early age because you're building on the wrong foundation. Somebody shall preach. You got to begin to build on the right foundation. In Jeremiah 2 verse 9, God says, and I'm hurrying up. God says, I bring two charges against my people. First of all, they have broken up with the real God. They have broken up with the only God that could keep them. He says, they have turned their back on me. They are the only true and living God. He said, the second charge I bring against them is that they have hewn out for themselves broken cisterns that can hold no water. And he says, I bring these charges against you, your children's children and your children's children children why because you have turned your back on the true foundation and you have gone to trade the glory of God for worthless idols and things that cannot keep you ain't got too much people shouting now pastor as a matter of fact, parents, your house would line up if you would start to build on the right foundation. You can't allow everything to go on in your home. How you could be up in church, in the choir, and doing all sorts of things for the Lord, but you got a daughter that at home ain't married and allowing the boyfriend to shack up in the house. I preaching. You see, pastor, here, yeah, he could beat me afterwards if I do anything wrong. But for right now, I'm trying to tell you all the truth. You got to build on the right foundation so even your house could be in order. Some of the things we going through, you can't blame God. When you look around your life and you see the mess that you're in right now, you cannot blame God. God says, don't blame me because from you were young, I was calling on your name to begin to build on this right foundation, but yet you never paid attention. And now all of the mess you see around your life is because you decided to go and hew out yourself for yourself, a broken system that could hold no water. My God, somebody say, preach, young man. 